guys, Eric here. Thanks for drawing with me today. I'm also going to be painting a little bit later, but you're welcome to follow along with marker, colored pencil, or whatever you have around your house. All you really need to get started is a piece of paper and something to draw with. Today we're going to make a really funky colorful ice cream cone that's going to look as if it's popping off the page. draw is our ice cream cone. It's going to look like a really long stretched out letter V. Now it's time to add in the bottom of our ice cream. I'm just going to do a few dashed lines going across and make it sort of curved. Then we're going to start to add in our ice cream dripping over the side. You can make some longer, some shorter. You got the picture. To add in the rest of our ice cream, let's start on the left side with one, two, three little bumps, and turn that top one into the little swirl that the soft serve machine makes. Now we're going to bring it down on the other side with one, two, three, I guess four bumps. Notice how they're a little bit higher. Now we're going to use three angled lines to sort of connect in between. Just make sure you don't connect all the way across. Guess what guys, we're already done with the drawing part of this project. Now comes the fun and satisfying to watch part. I'm going to color it in and crank up the speed and tell you some interesting ice cream facts along the way. And if you're enjoying our videos, don't forget to subscribe, like, and hit that notification bell to remind you when our videos go live every Wednesday and Saturday. I'm first going to fill in my cone yellow and then use brown to make an outline and crisscross marks. This will make it look like it's a waffle cone. Did you know waffle cones didn't exist until 1904? It was when an ice cream vendor ran out of cups and with the help of a waffle maker the next booth over came up with this delicious solution. So it looks like we're just about done with our cone. Let's get ready to move on to our ice cream. Looks like I've chosen pink. I suppose that could be strawberry ice cream? But my real favorite is chocolate chip cookie dough. Now grab your darkest color and make an outline all around your ice cream, and even over the lines. You'll see, just keep watching. Did you know that 9% of all milk produced in the entire United States is used to make ice cream? It also takes about 3 gallons of milk to make just 1 gallon of ice cream. That's a whole lot of milk. Milk? Pretty sure it's pronounced milk. Eric. Now that we're done with our darkest color, wash that brush or grab a new marker and get ready to do our next layer of color. I'm going with the slightly lighter pink. You know, an average American consumes about 48 cups of ice cream throughout the year. I bet you've all heard of the brand Ben & Jerry's ice cream. Did you know one of the founders, Ben, has a condition called anosmia, which means he has no sense of smell and nearly no sense of taste. He says this is why Ben & Jerry's has come up with so many funky, chunky flavors over the years. The texture. Apparently, Pecans are the most popular nut, and strawberries are the most popular fruit. I've been so busy boring you with ice cream facts, I forgot to tell you. Mix a little white in and fill in the rest of your ice cream. Over this next part, I'm just going to add some white highlights to make sure our ice cream looks nice and shiny. According to NASA, ice cream is one of the three foods astronauts miss the most when they go on space missions. Can you guess the other two? Pizza and soda. Kristen and I like to watch those cooking competition shows on TV, and I've always noticed they're making crazy flavors of ice cream. So I looked up a list of some of the craziest flavors. Cheetos, lobster, pickled mango, which is a cream cheese based ice cream with a spicy mango sauce, no thank you. Or in Japan, they even make octopus and squid flavored ice cream. I don't know if I'm brave enough for that. 
Anyways, I hope you guys have had fun drawing with me today. And don't forget to subscribe, like, and hit that notification bell to remind you when our videos go live every Wednesday and Saturday. Bye!